Hey guys, it's Jade with Metabolic Effect. Just want to talk to you a little bit about what exactly is the metabolic effect of exercise. So a lot of people when they hear about this afterburn of exercise, if they have any education at all, they usually think of EPOC, which stands for Excess Post-Exercise Oxygen Consumption or Oxygen Debt. And for those of you who don't know what that is, there's a very simple way to think about it. If you've ever gone up a large flight of steps or you've ever done a 100-yard dash or something like that, it's that point in time where when you finish the exercise, you're out of breath and breathing really hard. And that's kind of a micro example of what happens in a workout to create this afterburn or EPOC. The problem is the afterburn part of exercise actually has very little to do with EPOC. EPOC's a very small component. Other parts of that include the breakdown of muscle tissue and the fact that the body has to begin to build that muscle tissue back up. And that takes a, a long time. That can take up to 24 to 48 hours to do that. So when you think about the afterburn of exercise, you really want to look at four things. Getting the body breathless, making the body burn, getting the body straining under heavy weight, and getting the body hot and sweaty. We call those the B's and the H's. And what they do is trigger off key metabolic hormones that will lead to things like growth hormone production, testosterone production, and cause some of this afterburn. But more than just that, some of that tissue destruction that happens when you train at intense levels is also what determines this metabolic effect. So some of the things that uh, make a difference are how sore you get um, during exercise, how hard you push during exercise, how heavy the weight was during exercise. So it's very important to understand that this metabolic effect that we speak about that can last for several days comes only with very intense exercise, has to do with hormones, has to do with EPOC, has to do with muscle recovery, and has to do with several other factors that are very important.